Hello, my name is Sarah Spangolo and I'm the CEO and co-founder of Swarm Technologies. I'm excited to be here today to tell you more about Swarm and how we can help you scale your business globally. Swarm started because we were frustrated with a problem I'm sure many of you in the audience share today. There are not great low-cost global connectivity solutions. Solutions like LoRaWAN and Cellular are great if you are in range of these technologies. However, if you're outside of range of these technologies, there are simply not affordable, accessible solutions. Today, only 10% of the Earth's surface area has connectivity, leaving 90% disconnected with not great solutions. And this is really what motivated us to start Swarm about four years ago when we were founded. Swarm is the lowest cost available satellite network today. We're fully available. We have 81 satellites in space. And by the end of this year, we'll have our whole network of 150 satellites deployed. This means that every point on earth will be covered at all times um, and operators don't need to schedule when they're gonna transmit to satellites. They can wake up at any moment of the day and there will be on average three satellites overhead so they can just transmit their data, no problem. We also have globally coordinated VHF spectrum um, and our system is two-way, meaning you can relay messages to any devices that might be in remote locations around the world. And then we also do encryption. So we have secure communications for all of the data traveling across our network. And our system is available today. We have many customers that are actively testing and you can check out our website on how you can buy an eval kit um, and test it within a few days. You might be wondering how we're able to offer this low cost solution to customers and how we've done so so quickly. And this really comes down to our differentiation that is our technology. Our satellites are the smallest two way communication satellites in space. They actually fit in my hand. It's about 400 grams. We have 81 satellites like this in space. The way we've been able to make them so small is by taking out a lot of the heavy machinery to orient satellites and keep them in their orbits and come up with some new passive designs. We're also fully vertically integrated. So we build, design, test our satellites all in house. That means we can control the quality and we can also iterate really quickly um, and launch new designs every few months as new launch opportunities pop up. The fact that the satellites are so small is really important because launch costs scale directly with mass and volume of the satellites. So if you can shrink the satellites 10x, the cost of launching your constellation is reduced by 10x. So we're in the sweet spot where we're fully funded to put up all 150 of our satellites, um, considering the funding that we've already raised. Plus, we can pass all of these cost savings to the user, making this the lowest cost satellite solution out there today. As I mentioned, we have 81 satellites in low Earth orbit. We actually just put 36 satellites up on Sunday on a SpaceX, which is a very exciting day for all of us. And we're fully committed to five more launches through the end of 21 that'll put up the rest of our constellation, totaling 150 satellites. We've also deployed and we operate our own ground station network around the world. We've placed these ground stations in strategic locations such that customers have the lowest latency in getting their data back. Our range is quite large. You can see our satellite footprint um, is about the size of half of the size of the US um, and that enables us to optimize for global coverage. And you can actually track our satellites at swarm.space slash tracking to see where they are and if there's any overhead view right now. We announced our Swarm products a few months ago and we have our Swarm tile, which is a modem. It's about three by six centimeters um, it's 119 USD um, and it's available. It's also very low power. We're finding many of our customers can embed the tile with two AA batteries and have their devices transmit four times a day. And that device will last a year before the batteries need to be replaced or recharged. We also have our Swarm eval kit, uh, which is everything fully integrated required to talk to our satellites. We're sending many of these out to customers and they're able to get on the network and talk to our satellites in under an hour. So I encourage you to check that out on our website. And then of course our data, which is once again, the lowest cost available data uh, right now. And it's $5 per device per month USD. This is about four to 20 X lower cost than the legacy satellite providers like Iridium. Um, so it's kind of a no brainer for customers that are coming from traditional satellite when they consider the savings that they can have with Swarm. 
our swarm architecture is relatively simple. So the uh, tile is embedded within a product like a moisture sensor, an oil and gas, gas monitor, or a tuna fishing buoy. And then data is relayed from the device to the tile through our small eight inch antenna to our satellites every message that's sent is acknowledged to ensure high reliability of our system. And everything is initiated by the satellites and we use a time div division scheme um, in order to determine who talks to the satellites when. The satellites then downlink the data to our ground station network, which is around the world. And we use a store and forward system so that if the device is out in the middle of the ocean, the satellite can store that data until it passes over a ground station. However, we find that for most of our customers, because they tend to be in big countries um, where we've placed ground stations, the latency can be as short as a few minutes. Then data is uplinked to our back end, which we call the Swarm Hive, and customers can immediately access their data through APIs or a dashboard. Everything is also two-way, so messages can be relayed back to the device, for example, to change the temperature setting on a container ship that's traveling across the ocean. Um, and as I mentioned before, everything is encrypted to ensure a secure network. Swarm is really applicable across a bunch of different industries and our solutions are vertical agnostic. We find that Swarm brings the most value in applications across agriculture, logistics, environmental monitoring, energy, maritime, and global development. But people find new use cases for Swarm every day, it seems. As I mentioned, we have many customers on the network that are actively using the Swarm system um, from all over the world. Um, evaluation kits um, are, have been a very useful tool where customers can get on the network in under an hour. And many have now developed integrated products. One example is the ModuSense Gateway, which you can actually purchase on their website right now. Um, and we have many um, customer testimonials where people are talking about how easy it was to set up their systems how easy it was to integrate their tiles. And we're really excited um, to help you scale your business globally with Swarm's connectivity solutions. We aim to be as customer friendly as possible. We know there's a lot of developers that are very talented out there in the audience. So we've put all of our documentation online. It's available publicly. You can go check this out right now where we have our spec sheets, quick start guides, CAD files, and even reference designs to enable uh, this community to be able to build on top of Swarm as easily as possible. And finally, here's how you can contact us, our website, my email. I encourage you to reach out and very excited to work with all of you.